Hello, my name is Abu Sami. Today, I'm gonna show how to configure the uh, how to configure side-to-side -side VPN between two uh, two firewalls, and we're gonna have to find the connection between the two sides. So here is like uh, two parallel two firewall devices, and then we have the we need the management. We need the management. So I'm gonna connect this with a switch for this firewall. And then we need have two Kali machines in here. And then we also need the uh, web time one for the management. So I'm gonna connect it to management so internet is zero. And here is management internet one and internet three is yeah, sorry, internet two connected to the web ten and then we're gonna create a side to side VPN here is internet one slash one. Which is connected to each other, and Ethernet one slash two is connected to Kali. Ethernet one slash Ethernet one slash two is connected to Kali. It's pretty good now. This one is management. This one's going to be management. All right. So I'm going to assign the IP address in here. It's one nine two two one three eight dot ten dot. Uh, Two slash twenty four duplicate it is one hundred one slash dot twenty dot two slash twenty four and then it then one slash one gonna be one nine two dot one slash eight dot ten dot one slash twenty four duplicate twenty dot one slash twenty four all right. And then management IP address one nine two dot one three eight dot zero dot one slash twenty four zero two is gonna be the another firewall interface. This one is gonna this IP address is gonna be one eight one six dot zero dot three three dot ten. So it's pretty good now. And then we have the topology and the IP address as well. So for the for the VPN is which is connected to um uh, the firewall each other. So that IP address is gonna be ten dot uh, ten dot ten dot one slash twenty four and duplicate is ten dot ten dot ten dot two slash twenty four. Yeah. It is good now. So we gonna sign the cell here. This cell is trestle. So it's gonna be trestle. So I'm gonna be trestle. And then we have to create a CPN. So This one is going to be VPN and then I trust our as well. So VPN is called and trust all as well. And trust. All right. So we already set the IP. Uh, we already set the. We already draw the uh, topology and set the IP address. So we gonna. Uh, sorry. And then we have to configure the web time one. The web time one. It's gonna be the study IP. So address is gonna be three. Apply OK. We already have the IP address on the web time one too, so we uh we have to we need to assign the IP address on the Kali Linux as well. So we need to turn on all the device. So all the devices are turned on and then go to the Kali one and 
is open and to so yeah before we assign the IP address and we can configure the firewall so go to the firewall one and then admin all right so Now we are in the console. Um, so configure set uh, device. Oh, sorry, device conf config system type is static. Set device uh, config system um, IP address one nine two dot one eight dot zero dot one. Then matching two five five two five five two five five two zero and commit. And then we have to go to the file two admin. Yeah, we got it. And then config set device configure system in the uh, system type static. Set the bytes of the system IP address is 192.168.202. Number is 255.255.255.0. And commit. So after commit, we can access the web page of the firewall from the web timeline. So now let's go to the Kali and we have to assign the IP address on the Kali. So go to the edit connection. This connection IP address is manual at 192.168.10.2.1492.168.10.1. So save. Connect it. So we have the IP address for the Kali. If config, sorry. If config, yeah, 10.2. So that's good. Let's go to the another Kali. And we have to assign the another Kali IP address. Just connect it and add a connection, wire connection. And then IP address setting is uh, manual at 192.168.20.2. MS 192.168.20.1. Save. And then connect it. Now we got the IP address for the Kali 2 as well if config. So we want to uh, ping from Kali 1 or Kali 2 to Kali 1 or Kali 2. For example, Kali 1 ping to Kali 2 and Kali 2 ping to Kali 1 uh, by going through to the VPN. So we also have to configure the VPN on the firewall. But now we assign the IP address on the Kali Linux uh, respectively. So Let's go to the web time one and now we can access the web page of the firewall one https one nine two dot one eight dot zero dot one let's go and accept the risk admin so we can also go to the call um, firewall two as well because we have to create a side to side VPN on both machines. So uh, S2 is also set the colony. I'm sorry, set the firewall. Okay, now we are in the firewall one, and this one is firewall two. Here, we have to uh, configure the VPN here. So Let's get started. Before we create the VPN, we have to assign the IP address on the network interfaces. So 192.168, uh, sorry, Ethernet 1 slash 1 is like 10 or 10 or 10 or 1 for the VPN IP address. So I type is layer 3 and router is that port. And configure zone is 
is uh, address. Okay. IP address is channel 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 one slash twenty four. Okay. Then let's go to the internet one slash two. One slash two is one hundred one slash one hundred one. So type is layer three type. We're gonna use the layer three type and here is the default route and security is use all is traps traps all and then IP address gonna be in the one nine two dot one one slash twenty four. All right, so and the IP address here. So comment it. Let's comment it. Comment it. After create the commission. After create the commission. Um, uh, we gonna we gonna create the VPN. So. VPN. When we create a VPN, we can also uh, consider about the IKE crypto, IKE uh, IP crypto, and then IKE gateway as well. But we have um, IKE crypto and IP crypto is not essential things, but IKE gateway is necessary to configure when we create the VPN connection. So now we got the IP address on the key, uh, on the interfaces so let's create the v, uh, sorry, let's create the VPN channel so here is the VPN channel and then here is the add and channel 1 router is default and then we will create the zone for the VPN so VPN zone okay and then IPv4 is oh sorry we don't need to create IPv4 so let's create the tenant one it's already created the tenant one here and then we have to create the IKE gateway that's what I mentioned before so here is the IKE crypto and you can go to the platform and you can create your own IKE crypto and here is the IPC crypto and then you can go to the platform and you can create the own all IP side crypto. It's all up to you, but like I'm gonna leave as a default in this uh, tutorial, and then let's go to the IKE gateway. So in the IKE gateway, we have to create the IKE gateway. So add so IKE gateway name is side one IKE, and then the interface has to be the one slash one because uh, one slash one is gonna do uh, another internet one slash one for file file wall and it's gonna be the VPN so yeah one slash one and look at IP address gonna be look at IP address is 10.10.10.1 10 10 10 and P address 10.10.10.2 10 10 10 for the pre-share key we have to create the pre-share key pre-share key has to match with another pre-share key from the another file so just don't forget it That's my pre key and look at identification is IP address and the identification is also IP address. You have uh, we have any other options, but currently we're gonna use the IP address. So local IP address is 10 or 10 or 10 or 1 for the file one and which you would see here and the identification IP address is 10 or 10 or 10 or 2. So we create the IK gateway and if you want to create the IP, I, uh, no, no, we have to create the IP set tunnel, another IP set tunnel as well. So just go add, okay, add, and we're going to create the IP set tunnel inside dash one tunnel. And the interface has to be the tunnel one. And IKE the gateway is, uh, IKE gateways that we create the previous step is IKE the gateway. Yes. So IP set crypto profile is gonna be default that I mentioned a few seconds ago. On um, click OK. And then we create a tenor here. 
So now uh, we have to create the budget router. So go to the budget router and add, uh, sorry, no, you don't need to add it because we created a default route, right? So go to the default and study route. Go to the study route and add study route. And side one, sorry, side one route. And destination is gonna be one I So this uh, destination we want to reach from the from the this try zone so it's 192.168.20.u slash 24 whatever the IP address is uh, start with the 192.168.20 so 20.0 slash 24 and then the next hope is like we don't have the next hope so then and then for the interface we have to choose the tenant one so click OK now we already created the tenant one and click uh, sorry study route and click OK and then we create the study, uh, study route so after that we also need to create a policy for the traffic because these traffic is gonna reach this destination and these traffic is gonna reach this destination as well so we also need to create a policy security policy so I'm gonna create as a I'm gonna put the name as a traffic they have a find traffic out so is uh press VPN and then I want to see the log session because um we want to see the package from source to destination so I want to see the log so click OK and then we have to assign the security policy for reverse so it's gonna be the traffic in traffic in and that's gonna be from VPN to thread zone so I want to see the log session as well click OK all right so commit we also need to configure the same as like firewall 1 to firewall 2 so click remind me later and go to the network for the interface this commission is starting so then one slash one is uh, layer 3 our is default route we're going to use the default route security so is and trust zone and trust okay okay and then IP address gonna be 10.10.10.2 so it's ready for let's get it now for the internet one slash two we also need to assign the IP address it's type three router is for route so it's trestle TIQS trestle oh sorry trestle and then the IP address one two dot one say eight dot twenty dot two sorry ah one slash is one sorry one slash twenty four okay okay I'm gonna double check it because probably I thought that I'm gonna wrong something. But... All right, and let's get now. I'm gonna commit it. Here is like we already committed in here for the five hundred one. So let's go to let's go to see a channel. Channel is ten red, right? Look at that. After commission, we're gonna configure same as like the previous uh, firewall. You have to wait for a while. Close. And then now what we have to create a channel, right? So go to the channel and add. 
the node profile, the virtual router, and stuff. For our security zones, we have to create a VPN. Okay, VPN. Okay, okay. Now we have the VPN. Here is our IKE gateway. I'm gonna create the IKE gateway, same as like the previous uh, firewall. So site one IKE, and then interface is uh, one slash one IKE version one only mode. As a default, just let it be. For the local IP address is one slash two, uh, sorry one slash two, and the IP address standard one. And then pre check key is be careful. Pre check key has to sync with the previous uh, firewall. For me, it's like very simple password. Look at it, it's IP address, IP address is 10.10.10.2 for now, and 10.10.10.1 for the advanced option, and you cannot figure that key. So, click OK, and now we create a IKE for the IP set uh, IP set tunnel. We also need to create a tunnel for the firewall. So go to the tunnel. Side one tunnel. And the tunnel interface has to be the tunnel one. The IKE gateway. So we already created the IKE gateway here. And then the IP set crypto profile has to be the default. Okay, okay. And then we also need to create a virtual router. So go to the default route and study route. Go to the study route and create it. At site one route. And then one I two one say a dot. 10.0 slash 24 and then interface is 10 and 1 and then I get rest name or I get rest name. We don't have the next hole. Now we need to assign the policy. It's going to be same as I501. So go to click add and traffic. Traffic out is trust to VPN. I want to see the log session. Okay, and then traffic is in. So it's going to be VPN to destination is going to be trans. I change is log. You're going to see the log file. So after commit it, after commit, I'm going to ping from Kali 1 to Kali 2 and then the IP set channel tend to grin and then we can ping each other through the VPN and then we can monitor this um, log ping from Kali 1 to Kali 2 and Kali 2 to Kali 1 whatever it is it is what it is so let's let's go to the Kali 1 it's Kali Go to Kali 2. So do Kali. Here's the Kali 1 and Kali 2. I'm gonna paint 192.168.20.2. Let's see. Yeah. Finally, we can paint it, right? So I'm gonna keep painting and then we will see the firewall. Firewall one, the IP set channel, what's gonna be is ten grain, and then what about in firewall two? Go to the IP set channel, it's ten grain too. So ten, our tenant is working now, and then our tenant is working. Yeah, it's pretty good. And then we're gonna see the log file. So go to the monitor, and then session browse. Here's like paint traffic from Kali 1 to Kali 2. See? Yes, destination is 1, 2, 
I do my say dog. Ten dot two, when I do my say twenty dot two. You can see the very detail here. See? This package is through the tunnel, this package is through reach to the source to destination. Yeah, our side to side VPN configuration is finished now and see you in the next tutorial. Thank you.